shall we pray? Oh Lord God, how can we express our joy and gratitude as a people of our half region and Ghana at large? We thank you for seeing this day and witnessing this wonderful occasion. We invite your presence to be with us. Sit down, oh God, and share the affairs of this wonderful celebration. And in the end, we will have every cause to bless your holy name. Thank you because you have made it possible. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, have we prayed. Amen. Amen. Please be seated. Mr. President, good afternoon and welcome. This afternoon, we gather for a ceremony during which you publicly present the constitutional instrument for the creation of the Ahafu region. With us here this afternoon are a number of dignitaries who, with your permission, I would introduce. First, Justice S.A. Brobe and members of the Brobe Commission of Enquiry that worked on the petition to create the Ahafu region. Shall we receive them with a round of applause? The Honorable Dan Kwekuboche, Minister for Regional Reorganization and Development and other Ministers of State here gathered. Let's receive them with a round of applause. The Chairman of the Council of State, the Jabin Hine Nana Otuo Srebo, and members of the Council of State, let's receive them with a round of applause. The Vice President of the Republic, Al Haji Dr. Mahmoud Baumia. And His Excellency the President, Nana Adodankwa Akufuado. Your Excellency, I'd like to introduce Nana Owusu Entry, Secretary, Council of Ahafo Chiefs, to introduce the delegation from the Ahafo region. Yeah, thank you. Minister for Information, His Excellency the President of the Republic of Ghana, Nana Adodankwa Akufado, Nana Showboy, His Excellency the Vice President of the Republic of Ghana, Alaji Dr. Mahmoud Baumia, the Chief of Staff, the Chairman of the Council of State, the Chairman Justice Bobby, and members of the Commission of Enquiry into the Creation of New Origins, Ministers of State here present. Members of Parliament, MMDCs, the media, ladies and gentlemen. I introduce to you Nananum, the delegation from Ahafo, and for that matter, the petitioners for the creation of Ahafo region. His Excellency, the first item on the list, Nana Ansar Aduba, who is a paramount chief of the Ahafo Traditional Council and the president of Council of Half Chiefs. Very much, Cheku Ampim the third, Totrosu Mahine, the vice president of the council. Nana Fosuji Abua Akoto, the second, Beche Mahine, and the pre vice president as well, two vice presidents. Nana Osei Kofi Abre Kenyas number one, Mahine, and the chairperson of the fundraising committee of the council. Nana Kwasi Bosumpra, the first, Gosso Mahine, and the chairperson of the communication department of the Council of our Chiefs. Osahine Kwaku Atachi, the second, Kuku Mahine. Okufu Bua, Dr. Yao Ejay, the second, Mem Mahine. Oso Dumja Apia Jia Bua Fuhide Mahine. Ojidom Apia Kubi Pabu Katachi, the fourth, Sankwari Mahine. Nana Ousu Buadu Aye Buafo, representing Kenya Asin number two, Omahine Dadiako Insia Abebio. Nana Yao Bonsu, Achesa Mahine Rep, representing Professor Ajudi Adu Jemfi Ampim. Nana Kwaku Daku, acting president, Akode Traditional Council. Nana Oche Jonghene, Juan Quanta Mahine's Rep, representing Juan Quanta Mahine. Your Excellency, we have seven queen mothers from Ahafo. We are also here to grace the occasion. Nana Ajwapo Jamna Sewa Beche Mahima is here with us. Nana Ya Aduchuma Emrosa Kenya Asunamwa Mahima. Nana 
abu ajua tinkwama kenya asino matu mahima nana mincha yabua achenswa mahima nana kwatima amponsa ntotoso mahima nana ata ajua ajewa kodie hwide mahima nana sewa ampa braketuo who is here to represent kukum traditional council as I the president, we have other divisional chiefs who are here with the council to also grace the occasion. Nana Dansu AJ Ababio, who is the Inkasem Ene here. Oya my Apia Kubi, Ayom So Ene. Nana Anki Tabri the second, Nana Susan So Ene. Nana AJ Chum the second, Nana Wamahin So Ene. Nana Ousu Kunto Mehame Ahene, Nana Bofu Benin the third, Sienchem Ahene, Nana Ata Mensa the second, Dadia Soba Ahene, Nana Otri Sebo the second, Azufo Ahene, Nana Kojo Boadi the second, Siana Ahene, Nana Dr. Lawyer Boachi Yadom the second, Nana Anyam Ahene, Nana Atra Ahene Penin the first, Jadu Ahene's rep. Nana Kwaku AJ Okuja Mai the first, Dantano Hene. Nana Basua Kumayin the third, Nobeko Hene. Nana Bobi Fokuo Kwapon Hene. Nana Amwaku Jampa Abuom Hene. Nana Boachi Dankwa Fahuya Oden Hene. Opuna Wisie Redu Brimpon Kasapin Hene. It says, as the present, Nananum, every paramount, uh, every traditional council uh, were represented by two uh, chiefs from the traditional council. We have the first item, Yanfu traditional council, the two Nananum, uh, Nana Pepra Afrane, Nana Asamoa, for the two traditional councils. In total traditional council, we have Nana Jan Katachia the first. Nana Kwasi Amwa the first. Bechem traditional council, the two are Nana Boatin Obin, Nana Opoku Jumo, Kenya Sunom one traditional council, Nana Boache Boatin Jabuo, Nana Yao Ajay for Kenya number one, Kenya number two traditional council, Nana Opare Ado, Nana Asuka Bonri for Kenya number two. Go so traditional council, the two are Nana Onshra Poku. Nana Asamoa for the two. I transfer traditional council. Nana Adusi Poku Konkonko. Nana Kwachi Ababio. I transfer traditional council. Kukum traditional council. Oheneba Atachi one. Nana Ochi Ensia for Kukum. Hidium traditional council. Nana Ensia Ewea. Nana Kumi for Kuo. Hidium Sankori traditional council. Nana Anki Bo Siako. Nana Kwaku Aduse Sankwari. Akwodye Traditional Council. Nana Opon Chechaku. And then Nana Che Bafo for Akwodye. Dian Kwanta Traditional Council. Nana Amiya Basua. And Nana Opoku Nyakabi. Dian Kwanta. The last Traditional Council, the 13th one, is Mem Traditional Council. Nana Nkrumah Brobe, who doubles as a vice. President of our uh, Development Association, Accra Tema Branch. Nana Boache Ajenim for uh, Juan Kwanta. Yes, I'll come. I'll come. Yes. We have other members who, are, who also play a very key role in the creation of the Hafu region. We have Nana Kofi Ofori Ajay, who is the coordinator for the Hafu Council of Chiefs. Nana Sabe, who is from Hidium, who played a key role in the exercise. Nana Yao Bafo Asukwa, who is also here. Then we have Ahafo Development Association. Ahafo Development Association. The president is Mr. Yao Osu Brimpon, the CEO of Venture Capital Trust Fund. Kwaku Adai is the secretary of the council of the association. Engineer Seven Akuyako. The president of Ada Accra Tema branch is also here. Lawyer Opoku Mabua, secretary, Ada Accra Tema branch. Fred Fosu Aduchum, vice president of Ada Ahafo 
and the liaison officer of uh, uh, for regional question. Eric Adey, former DC, or, uh, His Excellency John Mahamas regime. Nana Francis Anane is also here with us. Yvonne Opoku Kwatin is here, Dr. Subontin, Mr. Michael Ofori, Samuel Osu Amanfo, Adom Ajenum Kwatin is also here. And with the entourage, His Excellency the President, among them is the regional house of chiefs president, Pinampem uh, Yao Cabrese the fifth, who is also the Yeji Mahinen and the president of Yeji Traditional Council, the president of Munafo Regional House of Chiefs. And with him is his vice president, Nana Bofo Benin the fourth, Nana Junim Mahine, and the president of Junim Traditional Council. Thank you very much. I'm done. Thank you very much. Mr. President, with your permission, I'd like to invite the Minister for Regional Reorganization and Development, the Honorable Dan Kwekubotri, for some remarks. Thank you. Your Excellency the President, Your Excellency the Vice President, Honorable Chief of Staff of the President, Honorable Senior Minister, Chairman, and Honorable Members of the Council of State, Honorable Colleague Ministers of State, Deputy Ministers, Honorable Members of Parliament, Honorable MMDCs, our revered Chiefs, the clergy, and a special mention of the President of the Brownfield Regional House of Chiefs, Pim and Pim Cabrese, and the Vice President, and the leader of the delegation from Ahafu Chiefs, Nana Ansa Aduba Omahino of Yanfo Traditional Area. The chairman and members of the Justice Brobe Commission. Mr. President, we shall keep repeating how happy we are to be part of this historic occasion. This is the fourth presentation to Nananum of the constitutional instrument. Mr. President, there's a joke of a radio broadcaster who tried to be very neutral in his work or is it her work? But when the results of elections were being announced, they announced that of a political party. Then, unconsciously, the person said, in a camp, Nayansu Yedansen, which immediately meant that he had showed his hand. Mr. President, Yes, this is the turn of Council of Ahafu Chiefs. And Mr. President, uh, with your permission, I'll say that I was born and bred in Ahafu. <laughs> so I can almost say, I do, yes, yes. Mr. President, on the 28th of February 2017, the Council of Ahafu Chiefs sent a petition to your high office. And the petition was signed by Nana Ansa Aduba Omahe of Yamfu Traditional Area, President of Ahafu Council of Chiefs. And that was what was on their letter here. Mr. President, yesterday we've talked about the vision and the commitment to fulfill the basic fundamental desire of the people of Ghana. Attached to the petition they sent to you on 28th of February 2017 was copies of petitions that have been sent to the former governments. And Mr. President, I have the copies here. You can clearly show 
that these were used typed by a typewriter, not by a computer. We have references from Ahafu Youth Association, and then you have those from the Council of Chiefs. Mr. President, we have the ones written as far back as 1986 to the PNDC chairman asking for the creation of a half a region. So it's clear that the quest for a half a region had taken really a long time. Council of a half a parliament chiefs, PO Boss 4, Achille 28 February 1987. Resolution in support of the petition sent by the Ahafu Youth Association on 28 February 1986 for the creation of the Ahafu region. And we have the signatories here Nana Asua Javifi, Momahine of the second Bechem, Nana Kwabi Bonsu, Omahine of Shudim, Nana Kwekwe Chap, Omahine of Kenya, number one, Nana Ansa Aduba, Omahine of Yamfo, and Mr. President, it continues. Then you have others too that were sent to by the Ahavu Council of Chiefs, Ahavu Youth Association, PO Boss 1, Gosso, 3rd December 1990. The chairman, PNDC, PO Boss 1627, Kasselusu, to the regional secretary. Petition for the creation of Ahavu Region. Reminder We attach herewith, for your kind consideration, a reminder to our earlier petitions dated 28 February 1986. 6 April 1987, and that of the Council of Ahafu Parliament Chiefs dated 28 February 1987, copy attached. We humbly implore your generosity and indulgence in this matter in the hope that you will give the petitions the consideration they deserve. Yours sincerely, Akira Mwabwatin, Acting Executive Secretary of Ahafu Youth Association. Then in 2003, Another petition was sent to the Honorable Minister of Local Government. So the petition for the creation of Ahafu has started long ago. In fact, the first one was PO Boss, PO Post Office Boss 1, K Post Office Boss 1, Gosso Ahafu. That was the earlier one sent on 28 February 1986. There was a discussion on Ahafu and its people. Before the British came, the British ruled. After the restoration of the Confederacy in 1935, creation of Brown Alpha region, the plight of Ahafos in the Brown Alpha region, administration of the Brown Alpha region, potentialities of the Alpha region, cocoa, timber, minerals, foodstuff. Mr. President, so these have been letters that have been written to former governments, and finally, the one on 28 February was sent to your half office, high office. This did receive attention from you. You proceeded to set a commission of inquiry chaired by eminent jurist Justice Brobe. They presented their report. You proceeded to follow the constitutional provisions. And now, after the Council of State advice, we have followed the procedure with your kind guidance and the number of times we consulted you, you had the patience to give us the guidance. Today, after going through all the processes, Council of Ahafu Chiefs and their people are here for you to give them the final instrument, the constitutional instrument as stated in Article 5.8, so that finally Ahafu region will become a reality. We thank you, Mr. President, for this time. Thank you. Thank you, and also for the history lesson on the very many petitions that started way ahead of time and how it has been resolved today. Mr. President, with your permission, I'd like to invite the spokesperson for the delegation. I'd like to invite, rather, the head of the delegation from the Hafu region to present their remarks.
Mr. President of the Republic of Ghana, Nana Adodankwa Ekufuado, the Vice President, Dr. Alaji Baumia, Council of State Members, Members of Parliament, and Ministers of State. On behalf of the people of our region, we would like to say a big ayuko for the work you initiated through the Council of State, Minister of in Charge of Regional Reorganization and Development, and all the supporting staff of the Electoral Commission of Ghana have done in the creation of the new regions and the Afro region in particular. Nana Adodankwa Akufuado, you promised through your party's manifesto that you will create new regions when elected to the office of the presidency. And true to your word, hard work, love for the country, Ghana for development reasons and prayers, the Afro region has now been created. You also exhibited your love for the rule of law by following the laid down procedure in the 1992 constitution in the creation of new regions. We are very grateful to you. We would like to extend our gratitude to the committee of inquiry set up by your excellency and headed by Justice Alain Broby to look into the creation of new regions. We say are you equal to them for their hard work and love for the country Ghana. The Afro people appreciate your passion in seeing to the development of the nation Ghana through the various projects that we have implemented. Mr. President, we the people of our region promise to pull all our resources together to develop our new region in a short time. Your Excellency, we are behind you and pray for the success of the various programs you have introduced, like One District, One Factory, Free Senior High School, education, Platform for Food and Jobs, and more especially, the rehabilitation and extension of the country's railway lines and many other flagship programs. The road will be rough, but Your Excellency, we know and believe that your love and hard work for the hard work in the country, the Almighty God will see the people of Ghana through. The people of Ahafu are very grateful and will pay, pray to the Almighty God to help you in your quest to build Ghana beyond aid. Where the determination exists, failure can never dismantle the flag of success. God bless Ahafu and make Ghana our nation great and strong through you as president. Thank you for your attention. Yeah.
Ladies and gentlemen, shall we receive His Excellency the President of the Republic with a round of applause and an ovation. Clergy, Vice President, Chairperson, and members of the Council of State, Chief of Staff at the Office of the President, Minister for Regional Reorganization and Development, Minister for Chieftaincy and Religious Affairs, Bronga Hafu Regional Minister and his Deputy, Ministers and Deputy Ministers of State, Members of Parliament, Chairperson and members of the Burby Commission, President of the Bronga Hafu Regional House of Chiefs, your Mahini of Yeji Traditional Area, Pima Pim Yao Kabrese V, the President of the Council of Ahafu Chiefs, Nana Ansem Eduba the Second of Mahini of Yanfu Traditional Area, other members of the Hafu Council of Chiefs, Amahini, Amahima, Nananum. Elders and members of the delegation from a half a region, the chairperson and executives of the Middle Belt Development Authority, fellow Ghanaians, ladies and gentlemen. I first of all to welcome you warmly to the seat of our nation's presidency, Jubilee House. In a few minutes, I'll present the constitutional instrument to the head of the delegation, symbolizing the coming into effect of the Ahafu region. After years of continuous petitions submitted to successive administrations, military and civilian, for the creation of this region, which yielded no results, the chiefs and people of Achirinshua Bechem Dwaya Mkwanta, Gosu, Kuku, Sankori, and Tema, and Tepa have finally had their wish fulfilled. I say a big congratulations for your determination and tenacity for staying the course and eventually seeing this through. Aiko. As I indicated yesterday, at the ceremony for the Northeastern Savannah regions. The clamor for the reorganization of administrative regions in our country has long historical antecedents. In the case of Ahafo, it dates back to nearly 40 years. Indeed, the petition of the, for the creation of this region was first submitted in 1981. And barely eight weeks into my mandate, on 28 February 2017, this same petition was submitted to me. I referred, in accordance with the dictates of the Constitution of the Republic, in Article 52A, on 26 June 2017, the petition to the Council of State for its advice. And on 15 August 2017, the Council advised that a Commission of Inquiry be established to determine whether or not there was a need and substantial demand for the creation of the proposed Ahafu region. What struck me in particular was the number of participants from Ahafu who were present at the public hearings held by the nine-member Commission of Inquiry, headed by the eminent jurists the retired Justice of the Supreme Court, Mr. Justice S. A. Bruby. In all, 20,203 people attended the five public hearings conducted in Ahafu. Those who spoke at these hearings did so with a unanimity of voice and were resolute in their conviction that the creation of Ahafu region would accelerate the development of the area, 
thereby resulting in improvement in the quality of the lives of its residents. Indeed, when residents of Ahafo had to fulfill the threshold stimulate, stipulated by the Constitution on 27 December 2018, they recorded the highest turnout of any of the other referenda on the day. That is 90.42% of the registered electorate. Out of the 277,663 who cast their ballot, 276,763, representing 99.67%, voted yes. With the Ahafo region home to large deposits of gold, diamond, iron ore, and bauxite, and with significant percentage of the nation's food produce coming from there, the potential for development clearly exists. Residents of Ahafo are of the firm belief that there will be better access to government institutions, better population to service ratios, enhanced employment, and increased socioeconomic activities, and increased investment opportunities. It is thus only fitting that government helps to accelerate the, de the development of this region. Within one week of the declaration of the results, I constituted on 3rd January 2019 a seven-member government committee chaired by the dynamic and sagacious Minister for Regional Reorganization and Development, the Honorable Dan Bote, MP, with the Minister for Planning, Honorable Jambafo, MP, the Minister for Local Government and Rural Development, the Honorable Alima Mahama, MP, the Minister for Special Development Initiatives, the Honorable Mavis Kawa Kumsen, MP, the Minister for Finance, Kelo Furiata, the Minister for National Security, Albert Kandapa, and the Presidential Advisor, Dr. Kwame Tufu, as members to plan and oversee the rapid development of the Ahafu region and the, other, and the five other newly created regions. In the President's 2019 budget, an amount of 20 million CD has been allocated as seed capital for the smooth takeoff of the Ahafu region. Nananum, until the appointment of a substantive regional minister for Ahafu, I have asked the current regional minister for Brong Ahafu, the Honorable Evan Supoku Bobie, member of parliament for Snafu North, to act as caretaker minister. Gorso has also been chosen as the capital of the Ahafu region. I want to assure residents of the region, however, that government projects and structures will be equitably spread across the region. This, Nananum, ladies and gentlemen, is the beginning of a better and brighter future, not only for Ahafo, but also for Mother Ghana. With creativity, hard work, and innovation, we can together work to bring progress and prosperity to all parts of our country. Let's work at it, and I'm confident we shall succeed. Accordingly, Mr. Vice President, and unknown ladies and gentlemen, I'll now present to the head of the delegation the Constitutional Instrument CI114, giving effect to the results of the referendum of 27 December 2018, as certified by the Electoral Commission in Gazette No. 12 of 2019, and thereby creating the Ahafu region, and sign the instrument of attestation to these facts. May God bless Ahafu region and us all and may God bless our whole land, Ghana, and make her great and strong. I thank you for your attention. Thank you, Mr. President.
Mr. President will now proceed to sign the document of attestation. May I invite the head of the delegation from their half origin in the company of four other chiefs, making a total of five chiefs and five chiefs only, to witness the signing of the document of attestation. The head of the delegation is invited in the company of four other chiefs, making a total of five chiefs to witness the signing of the attestation document by His Excellency the President. The document reads, Nana Adodankwa Ekufuadu, President of the Republic, on 13th February in the year of our law 2019, presented the constitutional instrument CI114 for the creation of the Ahafo region to the head of the delegation from the Ahafo region. It's under the signature of the President of the Republic, Nana Adodankwa Ekufuadu. He will add to it copies of the constitutional instrument 114 and do a public presentation of same. Ladies and gentlemen, a big round of applause. CI 114. That gives effect to the creation of the Ahafo region. It's just been publicly presented and copies of it, in addition to the attestation document made available to the head of the delegation and the chiefs and people of the Ahafo region. Congratulations, Ahafo region. Congratulations. History was made at 10 minutes past four, today the 13th of February 2019, when the Half Origin was officially given effect. I want to invite the Deputy Minister for Works and Housing, the Honorable Frida Pempe, for a quick translation of the President's speech into the local language for the benefit of the thousands who are watching us live on television back at home in their half region. Don't have free the Thank Excellency, the President of the Republic of Ghana, Nana Dudamkwa Akufuado. Your Excellency, the Vice President of the Republic of Ghana, Dr. Mahamadou Baumia, 
the Honorable Chief of Staff, Honorable Fremo Ose Opare, the Chairman of the Council of State, Nana Otuo Srebo, Nana Nom, Honorable Ministers of State present, Deputy Ministers present, present, Honorable MPs, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, I've seen uh, Honorable MMDCs here as, as well. Nana Nom, Ewe Mi Bejina Ha, Na Mi Jina, Oman Penye, Asamu Okan, Yeso, Yeso Mi Me Pone Tofa, Na Asamu Ya Dedo Dunti, Ya Mone Tofa, Ye Pense Mi Pense Mu, and my we are singing now, and the Ghana for an end, you know, who are the fair far. And then now, Nana, the damn quail, Kufu, the Sony MPP, so ye done a deed, a world jubilee house, honey. Nana, at the damn quail, a Kufu, the President of the Republic of Ghana. Then Casa Emuno, or the Kaman, and then when you know, a quaba. No, the two ja, and a more I am Nananum, a free bayer if ye are Diana Chi, and a more yet two. I hear pray say you be who I have for region. Yen na na me free a change so ya go so be change dia yang kwanta san kwari kukuom yamfo yen na na nwe di mwa kutini ye pa. Enu jine chino na na do dam kwa kufuado. Wasi na na nwe de wa wase mhi adbetu ne nimno. Se di onu anka sa so o tu aplaus wa share gan na fo ni na abono. Se o be creative regions ni biya kan. Do do ni do na ye wa nuhu dadano. Nana Mode, you hear some better than him, Nana Anto Tunasi. Nineteen eighty one, Nana Mutu and Juan among, and to me, Uncle Drew in Pempensua, Barbedry. Name one another dunker for the pay so. Yet the Frank Carnation in two thousand and seventeen January. February Nana and Anamo said to an among, Eddie Batuna named him. Nana the dunker could for the so one or so. Or to Juan among, said their constitutional. Yamra Penny Nichiano, at the Quadra Council of State for Ya Papa, and no trust of was on any dom, a year moon pays a moon pays a moon, at the far quaint be assessed a fasso, and winter Nayati Justice J. Broby, Commission is a moonshire, a quiet befasua, creation of the region and as I have for region, near regions and our caninano, ye bet to me at it, a one no quaint so. Now Justice Broby, so soon in the dom, a two one and more be. Now, bra mu tu hwa na mo bo ahafo importa mu no ahafo fo de ya ji rutu mu pa enu nti no ene ne ye hu de ye hu na 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 ma ye hu se ahafo de ya de bia na ka ga na beyond aid ya wa lot of your resources be bi ya wa ahafo e wo gold ya wa diamond ya wa bauxite ya kedua ne a ya wa bodia ya wa banchi ya wa bro ya sa so so e wo koko pa e free ahafo Na 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 ni mse sa creation sa hafu ya yati ebe ma impuntu impuntu aba ya impotem na abe ya na ya ya resources ya gudi ya ni ya ni ama ya wawa hafu mantem ya timia pejem na timia kongai na ya mbulu ni ya mranti ya soso enya ejuma soso aye na nu ya eba se ya kwa ya referendo mi ya di ya hafu fua di twenty seven December aye debia. Eh, ye you ain't confida, because the sad dano and I have a fortune say, na na ye piti shi na ye di betu we ni mno ye tu huwa na mwau, ampe ni ampa ye tu huwa na mwau, eh madudu na ne tu abano, ye vi abatu ano, na chesa have a fortune, ye ka ni pa e tu yes, sa ye pa have a fortune na, e ye ni pa two hundred and seventy six thousand seven hundred and three, o pe 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 ma he nu. Edu or soon see ya, a hand soon, Edu or so me and sir. I a chair, so who boom compound co percentage moi. A chair ninety nine point six seven per cent. Not yes, eh? A car baku baku, Edu, a son, eh, me and sir. And Edu, a son, me and sir, thirty three point thirty three. Not yes, I have four. Nana, ya two hundred per cent. A kaki to a be. Not yes, eh? I have four that ya jatum, sir, half original, ya pay. Na na so so ya to sa percentage wa sa so so to minister sa kukudam ah ya 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 nua panyi onu abodam kwa kubotwe ah oda no mi aye nua ba haji alima mahama minister for local government no so ka ho onu abo hawa kumsen minister for president special initiatives on so ka ho ya ya nua panyi on so free bromantem professor jamba for onu so so e ka ho 
constitutional instrument one one four so and then all that I have for region D. Sagana for TAO, I have for four TAA, Nana, I have for mine at the Wassay. Nana say, All that I have for Edino. Now you are him crocus here. I already to ja, and my own half for more, and ya ya him crow go so. Nana Naka go soon, we are no. Was so all betcha in Puntu Jumano. I'm a baby, a baby, a Enko ba se, ya de go asu e si wasa a him kronti. Nam pun tu juma ni nina ye kwa kan, ye kwa kan she e wo go asu. Ye wa him kron bebre. Ye wo bechem kan ye hon. Ye wo duyam kwanta kan ye hon. Ye wo achensu ya kan ye hon. Ye wo kukwom kan ye hon. Sankore ya mfo. Ni nina kan ye hon. Ye beche, nanasu o beche. Ama nasu e kron bi asu. Na nanadi nanu se mu tu jano. Wasi di e ni feye na hum kase. San si se yei, ebe ma a hafu mai a peja. San si se yei, ebe ma ga na mai a peja. San si se yei, e di mpuntu o, ebe ba ye mpotem, mpotem. Ene, se a greater akura origin ha, ye wo, be bi e fren airport ha, a hafu me mtusu airport e be ba ho. Ye wo be bi a, ye fren e regional hospital ha, a hafu me mtusu e bi e be ba ho. Ye wo university se wo, bunu isi ni bunu ha. I have for my sister, baby, baby, ho. It's a regional institution, sir. What? Bruno, the man, tell me, you know. And then another down, quite a cool for a do. Now, that room, and tea, baby, baby, I have for. Never, but no, so if you're not now, the manifesto, the team, and that's all. I had job creation. It is our input to you, my baby, 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 institution, see, you know. Never, my crime, my memory, my auntie, and my bar, where I have for my term, so so no, and your juma, so so I hear. Eti ane a half of mine, ya tida, ya tida ne, ya da nana do dan kwa a kufu a do. Ane, na bain a se, se ne, yen so so, wama ya diye hu. Na me di manu se mu e si, nana do dan kwa a kufu a do. Ane we jina, gana mine ne mu, a da a half of mine, e di, by constitutional instrument, one, one, four. Nana no, nana na se, nana no, nana anu a se mu, gana mine. I will do two journey. Woman, you say, and you are no mutti and be brave. I will gana and then import him in a Madame Winna. Well spoken. The Honorable Frida Prempe MP hails from the Hafo region. I'm sure you can tell from the passion with which she speaks. Ladies and gentlemen, I want to invite Mr. Yao Ousu Brimpong, President of the Hafo Development Association, to uh, share with us their vote of thanks very quickly, and then we'll take the closing prayer, the national anthem, and then the final photographs. His Excellency, the President of the Republic of Ghana, Nana Adodankwa Ekufuado. His Excellency, the Vice President of the Republic of Ghana, the Chief of Staff of the Presidency, the Chairman of the Council of State, the chairman and members of the commission of inquiry into the creation of new regions, ministers of state here present, members of parliament, Nananom, MMDCs, the media, ladies and gentlemen, I'm honored to be called upon to give the vote of thanks for such an important occasion. Let me start by saying that the dream for the Afro region started almost 40 years ago. Today, on the 13th of February 2019, it is no more a dream, but a reality. And on that note, we need to give thanks to all those who work hard to make sure this um, happened. Our first thanks goes to the Almighty God for giving us such a weather, even for the occasion. And our second thanks goes to the President of the Republic of Ghana, Nana Ajiwudin Osiadieyo Akufu Adon. 
He said it when he was going, when he was campaigning, and he's done it for us. We started this 40 years ago, and I have to say that one major difference between the current struggle for the Afro region and the past is the political will of the government. The will of the government was there, so it made our work much easier. Mr. President, we, we thank you. Words cannot show or cannot express the kind of appreciation we have. All that we are saying is, may the good Lord continue to give you long life and then healthy life so that you can continue to give Ghana a good leadership. May the good Lord bless your womb and bless your generation unborn. We also have to express our appreciation to all the heads and the various institutions that contributed to the process. The chairman of the Commission of Inquiry to the Creation of Region and his members, the Ministry of Regional Reorganization and Development, Honorable Dan Kwekuboche, for the good work done, the Council of State for the advice given to the President to go ahead with the creation of the region, the Electoral Commission, the Nananum from Ahafo, for the kind of leadership they gave, the unity and the peace they gave us during the uh, campaign and the uh, work towards the region. The people of Ahafo, for the turnout of 90.1% and 98.68% uh, yes, that actually showed that Ahafo, we did uh, work for the region. Before I take my seat, Nananum and the people of Ahafo have whispered into my ears to assure the president that what we are going to use to thank him is that come 2020, we will paint the six constituencies of our foreign in the political colors of the NPP. You will see six MPs from our foreign, and that is the only way. We know that is what will please you as our thank you. Long live Mr. President, long live Ghana, long live Ahafo. Please let us be in the mood for the closing prayer, please. Almighty Allah, we once again thank you for a very fruitful and a powerful moment of history once again. Absolute glory and praise are your due for making yet another powerful historic moment through the iconic leader of the country, the Commander-in-Chief of the Ghana Armed Forces and the President of the Republic of Ghana. Bless all the actors in the process who made it possible for us to assemble here once again. Grant the leaders of new Ahafu region with whatever success your magistrates possess. Unearth the natural resources for the progress of the region. Oh Lord, we praise you for this historic moment. Guide our dear nation Ghana and bless its entire citizens with the unmerited favors of the year 2019. We single out and we ask for your presence to take absolute control over our senior ministers, council of elders, and ministers and MPs, above all, the vice president and the president of the Republic of Ghana. Show them your natural path to always give their best to humanity. Use them for greater works. Let them be the climax of peace and tranquility to sacrifice their divine gifts to mankind. At the end of the day, we give glory to you and we ask for your traveling mercies to our various destinations. We give glory and say at the end of the day, Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen, Ar-Rahman Ar-Rahim, Malik Yawm Al-Din, Iyaka Na'budu wa Iyaka Nasta'een, Ihdina Sirat Al-Mustaqeem, Sirat Al-Ladhina An'amta Alayhim, غير المغضوب عليهم ولا الضالين آمين
your seats. 